What is going on guys? Sorry for the wobbly camera there. <laughs> Welcome to the video. My name is Brando Linick and um, we're going to be talking about working from home. We're going to be talking about jobs and business. Um, so this video conversation is going to be broken up into like two different sections and sometimes uh, you know, this is just not going to be for some people. Sometimes this is going to be for some people. You'll be able to figure that out on your own. Um, but to kick off this conversation, I want to talk about, in the first part, uh, data processing jobs and doing them from home. How you can actually do this. Some people call it data processing. Other people call it data entry. Um, virtual assisting is also something people like to, to you know, reference it by. In the process of doing this, there's, there's different ways you can do it. Uh, of course, no-brainer, right? Um, tell me something I don't know, right, Brando? Uh, best tip I would give you is just apply for a data processing job in your local community, your city, wherever you're from, um, like you regularly would do for any type of job, okay? Um, when you get hired, here's the kicker. Some of you are like, well, Brando, when I get hired, when I go apply for a job, wouldn't I just get hired and be in an office? True, okay? Um, but the thing is, with data processing, once you get hired in a job, you have an employer, you're around employees, you're doing data processing, data entry, and you're doing it in a, like a, not a cubicle, but in an office setting with other people, what you can do is in your first week or when you get hired, you can make a request, okay, and see, because once you have the job, you can actually make a request, or after you've worked one day in the office, make a request, okay, you're going to have to build up some confidence and go to your employer. And because what you're doing is just working on the computer most of the time, just throw it by them. Negotiate with them. Throw by them the idea if you would be able to for seven days, all right, request if you could do it for seven days, even though you just started, you could see yourself focusing more and being more effective in your work doing data processing and entry, uh, you know, from your home without distractions from other employees around you and throw that idea by them if they, you could test it out for seven days um, and if you are more effective, if you're more efficient, you produce more results, you get more stuff done that they not only give you more work but they actually allow you for until you quit okay, to actually work from home so that's one way you can do it and um, you know it, it's probably the most lucrative way to do it, most basic way to do it um, also one of the most overlooked ways to do it, just going to your employer so I hope that makes sense. I encourage you guys to really try it. If you know data processing and data entry is your thing, that's something you're passionate about, go for what I just shared with you, run with it. Um, but if you're watching this video right now on the flip side of the coin and you're wanting to just do this because you want to work from home, you want to create your own income from home, you want more time, freedom, and flexibility, the caveat to working a job from home, any job from home, I'm not putting it down, but there is a caveat to it, that is having someone telling you what to do and how to do it. And I don't know about you, when it comes to working from home and having someone telling you what to do and how to do it in your own home, and you having to meet quotas and deadlines and you know supposed to do certain things throughout the day, it can be very stressful where you don't feel like you have freedom to do what you want. You're in your home, but you don't have the things and you can't do the things that you want to do because you got to get a certain 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 amount of work done. All right, because your employer expects more from you because they're giving you more access, and more privilege, and more freedom. So it's just something to keep in mind, and that's why in addition to this video, I just wanted to share with you, um, not talking about data processing jobs anymore, I wanted to share with you my experience when it comes to working from home. All right, when it comes to working from home, I would encourage you learn how to build your own income, learn how to create an income that you can control, all right? So when you're like, Brando, building a business, that's not for me. Okay, then the rest of this video is not for you. But if you hear me out here for a minute, um, for those of you, and this makes sense to you if you're wanting to build an income from home to have time, freedom, and flexibility, I would encourage you learn to leverage the internet. Learn how to build uh, your own income through the internet, through systems. This is exactly what I did going back to 2014 when I was working uh, about 40 hours a week in a restaurant as a baker. And on the side of that, what I would do, my story was, um, when I was working this job, <laughs> I'd be scheming up ways to work from home online. I'd be scheming up different business opportunities when I was on break or after I was done my shift. And then I eventually came across a person after trial and error who was making a lot of money on the internet building a business and modeled and copied them. And it took me a period of about three months to create a full-time income working part-time from home because I didn't have to deal with the overhead of a traditional based business where you have employees and secretaries and assistants and supplies and creating 
creating your own product and because I didn't have to do that or you know pitch people or sell people I was able you know to create those results which are not average or typical which is why I would encourage you learn to leverage the internet if you want to work from home and build an income and you want to have time freedom and flexibility the internet's the best way you could do it um, and then model model someone model and copy someone who's already doing it um, it'll save you a lot of blood sweat and tears if you're just willing to be humble put the ego off to the side and find someone who can be a mentor for you so I hope you enjoyed this video, it's been fun talking with you, and if you have any questions or comments on one or the other that I discussed in this video, you can comment below and I'll get back to you, but uh, before I end out, if you are interested and this made sense to you from a business perspective, an opportunities perspective of having more time freedom in your life, being able to move into that bigger, better home, buy that car, have more time freedom for your family, to do this using the internet to build your own income, if it made sense to you, if you're coachable and trainable, you're open-minded, connect with me on my site, check it out. It's 123marketingtips.com. I will put a link in the description below, and I'll personally connect with you there. And I'll see you on the beach of the world. Take care.